the defendant, Jose Lindetta, refused to appear in court. The judge said his trial will move forward even if he's not there. In its opening statement, the prosecution described a heated online argument between Jose Solano Landetta and his former girlfriend, Karina Castro, just hours before her death. They also claimed that in an Instagram message exchange with a friend, Landetta expressed anger at Castro and implied that he intended to harm her. Prosecutors say that following that exchange, Landetta left his work in Berkeley, drove to his home in Hayward, retrieved a sword, drove across San Francisco Bay, and confronted Castro in front of her apartment building in San Carlos. They also alleged that following an argument, Lendetta swung the sword at Castro and struck her in the arm. As she ran away, he continued swinging the sword, cutting off some of her hair. Prosecutors say that when she fell to the ground, Lendetta struck her repeatedly in the neck and head. She died at the scene. They claim the motive for the attack was vengeance, that Lendetta was angry at Castro for threatening to disparage him on social media. During its opening statement, the defense argued that Lendetta is a paranoid schizophrenic who is not taking his medication. They also claimed that Castro had threatened to have Lendetta and his family killed. They say that Lendetta, believing he was in danger, took the sword with him as a precaution, but that his intent was to confront Castro in an attempt to de-escalate the situation. The defense also claims that during their argument in front of the San Carlos apartment building, Castro tried to stab Lendetta with a small knife and that he attacked her with the sword out of self-defense. All right, back live now. Witness testimony has begun. It continues this afternoon. Uh, the judge has said that there is a lengthy witness list, so this trial could go on for some time. But for now, in Redwood City, Charles Clifford, Cron 4 News.